Outer Bank star Chase Stokes just shared the secret to John B's physique, and we have all the details. I'm Gina Rosenberg. I'm Gabby Conti, and this is your 24-7 Celebrity News. Chase Stokes just came out as a flexitarian, which I guess is like you just have a kind of flexible diet. According to Chase, it means that he eats everything from steak to a vegan diet, but most of his diet is made up of protein, which is how he keeps his John B physique. And in terms of the protein that he eats, he sticks mostly to plant-based protein alternatives, but his flexitarian diet allows him to go off eating vegan once in a while. Off camera, Chase tries to live somewhat of a similar active lifestyle as the character he plays on his hit Netflix show. As Chase said on an Instagram Live, John B runs a lot. So Chase Chase has to run a lot. Makes sense, Chase. Can't, can't argue that logic. Totally makes sense. I love that he called himself a flexitarian. I might have to steal that. <laughs> I'll credit him, but I'm the same way. Like, I will eat vegan food, but mm. I will eat a filet mignon. Yeah. Sorry. I don't know. I mean, you know, I think every, it's everything in moderation, right? You Definitely. know, at the same time, yeah. I don't I don't think that eating, especially um, like plant-based protein all the time is like the way to, especially like fake, yeah. fake meat is like kind of, because a lot of time, like you might think like, oh, it's better for me because it's vegan and then you read the ingredients and there's all these like chemicals in it. So, totally. and I'm sure Chase is aware of that and I'm sure that's what he follows. But. Absolutely. Yeah. While Chase is a relatively flexible diet, there are certain foods this actor will not eat. Rather, this is one specific food he avoids entirely and that's pickles. Chase cannot stand pickles as Chase confessed recently on an Instagram Live. It's been since I was a little kid. I don't know how to describe it. I just have this weird hatred for the little green thing that you put on cheeseburgers. While Chase won't eat pickles, he is trying to convince fans to be more flexitarian and try more plant-based meat alternatives on an Instagram Live with his co-star and girlfriend, Madeline Klein. The two talked about how much they love experimenting with plant-based burgers, sausages, and even chicken. I'm yeah, here for it. Like, sure. I've, I've had, I'm like, we live in LA, so obviously it's a very <laughs> big vegan lifestyle here, mm -hmm. and I've tried it all, and I really enjoy it. Um, sometimes I'm like, could I do this for the long haul? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I just grew up in such a big, like, meat eater family. Sure, no, that's um, fair. And however, a lot of, yeah. maybe I'll try it. Well, you know? a lot of diet, too, is like who you're around and what your lifestyle is. Yeah. So if you're around a lot of meat eaters, it's probably harder for you to maintain Definitely. a plant-based diet, although people do it all the time. Yeah. Um, and it can seem expensive, so it's also budget and like figuring out how to yeah. do it. But I will tell you, there are some really good veggie burgers and veggie there sausage are. that you can either buy or make yourself. Well, Chase actually is so into cooking now that he actually even wants to have his own cooking show. As when the cheat sheet asked Stokes if he would ever do a cooking show, the actor responded by saying, it's funny you say that I have wanted to do something food related and we're kind of exploring it. It could be something in the future that we dive into. Recently, Chase teamed up with Sweet Earth Foods, a plant-based food company on Instagram. In a post with him and Madeline on the barbecue, he said that he's been working on perfecting a perfect plant-based barbecue. So if he can conquer that, I feel like he could be a good contestant on Chop oh, or any yeah. of those other shows. Oh yeah, I yeah. want to try his plant-based barbecue. I mean, honestly, like I feel like plant-based stuff just makes you feel a little better. It I does. will say when I'm not eating, it's like a lot of dairy sometimes. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I'm such a foodie, it's so hard for me to say no to things, however. <laughs> um, yeah, but um, it's really cool that he's, like, this has made me more aware of being maybe possibly more plant-based, you know? Right, and I think, you know, again, everything in balance, and I feel like perhaps that's the basis behind the flexitarian diet. Yeah. Um, also, the fact that Chase is exploring some cooking show ideas makes me think that there could be something in the works or something he's been wanting to Definitely. do. And I could totally see him doing something like uh, Zac Efron did with Down to Earth. I feel like yes. it would be really cool to have, especially knowing that Chase doesn't like pickles. I would love to do a show where, you know, someone tries to convince Chase that fermented that foods are actually really yeah. good and he should try them. So funny. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it's also very quarantine friendly. Like cooking it is. shows. Yeah. So yeah, maybe we'll get some good Chase Stokes cooking content. I would I'm here for love it. Love Chase and Madeline to do an Instagram live where they show us cooking they dinner. Cook. That would be very cute. It comes as somewhat as a surprise that Chase likes to cook. Previously, we've only seen Madeline show off her cooking skills. Like the one time Chase got so excited because his girl was making ravioli, and then he confused fans when he said he ate an insane amount of that cheese stuffed pasta. Seems like Chase and Madeline are enjoying each other's company as they get ready to shoot season two of Outer. Bay which we all cannot wait we for. We cannot wait for that. And there's some other projects that Chase is working on, but he is taking the social distancing thing really seriously. Mm -hmm. He said also specifically, you know, keeping him and Madeline's health like very, very, like as as good as they can is, yeah. is imperative because they don't want to be in a situation where when they do start filming again, that they don't they put their, go. yeah, not only they can't go, but also putting the whole cast and other cast and crew in danger. So they've Absolutely. been like staying together and keeping it very serious. That's what we do here at Hollywood. That's what we do, same thing. What do you guys think of Chase's flexitarian diet and eating a lot of plant-based foods? Uh, do you want to see Chase Stokes host his own cooking show? Let us know. I'm Gabby Conti. I'm Gina Rosenberg and follow us here at Hollywood 
for your 24-7 celebrity news.